the troops are called together. The company is assembled to elect representatives to attend the big meeting to celebrate the uniting of all the militia regiments into the new brigades of the People's Army. The clenched fist of Republican Spain. Enrique Lista, a stonemason from Galicia. In six months of fighting, he rose from a simple soldier to the command of a division. He is one of the most brilliant young soldiers of the Republican Army. one of the first commanders of the 5th Regiment. He talks of the army of the people, how they are fighting for Spanish democracy and for the government they themselves have chosen. Fighting together, we shall win a new, strong Spain. Camaradas! El quinto regimiento desaparece. Viva nuestra capital, el Madrid invencible. Viva el ejército popular, el ejército de la victoria. Adelante, por una España potente y feliz para la victoria. Salud. Jose Diaz. He used to work 12 hours a day as a typesetter before he became a member of the Spanish Parliament. <laughs> Gustav Regler, one of the fine writers of Germany who came to Spain to fight for his ideals. He was gravely wounded in June. Regular praises the unity of the people's army. The defense of Madrid will remind men always of their loyalty and courage. Für seinen Heroismus einen Gruß an seine Toten und heute an diesem Tage ein Gruß für den weisen Verzicht, den dieses Regiment von Revolutionären gegenüber der Notwendigkeit zeigt, die Volksarmee zu schmieden. Salut! The most famous woman in Spain today is speaking. They call her La Passionaria. She speaks of the new Spain. It is a nation disciplined and brave. It is a new nation forged in the discipline of its soldiers and the enduring bravery of its women. The loudspeaker broadcasts to the rebels. Living in the cellars of that ruined building are the enemy. They are moors and civil guards. They are brave troops, or they would not have held out after their position is hopeless. But they are professional soldiers fighting against a people in arms, trying to impose the will of the military on the will of the people. And the people hate them, for without their tenacity and the constant aid of Italy and Germany, the Spanish revolt would have ended six weeks after it began. 
This battalion goes on leave, and Julian, who is with them, has three days leave to the village. of Alba's palace is destroyed by rebel bombardment. Treasures of Spanish art are carefully salvaged by government militiamen. Camaradas de la 12 bandera. Os habla José Neiva. ¿Me conocéis? Me encuentro hoy entre mis hermanos del ejército del pueblo, donde he recibido un trato excelente. Aquí no impera el trato bestial que nos dan en esas filas. <risa> 